Good morning my friends, it's 5.30 in the morning and I'm getting ready to go and shoot the sunrise. For a good part of the road I have thick fogs, but the minute I've got to the sunrise part, the fog opened and I have a clear view to the mountain and I I think it's going to be a beautiful sunrise, so I'll take my gear and hike a little bit. I've reached the spot from where I'm going to shoot the sunrise. The atmosphere is spectacular. I have no clouds in the sky, unfortunately, but I have some great fog right on the mountain, so it's going to be great. I think it's going to be awesome. The minute the sun will hit that fog. I really hope that fog stays until the sun hits it. I think it's going to create some interesting composition, so I'll get my gear ready. Sunrise will be in about 20 minutes and I've already made my first shots. And this is another thing that you should be always careful to reach the sunrise spot with at least 30 to 40 minutes before the actual sunrise and this will create some great opportunities mainly because you'll be there at the right time now from what I'm seeing uh, it seems that the mountain is going to be surrounded by fog really hoping that the Sun will break that fog and I will be able to photograph it but when whenever you are near a mountain that big you can't control the forecast, you can't control the weather. It, it can be sunny one minute and the next minute it, the whole thing gets surrounded in mists and fog and it is what it is. So I'll, have, I'll just have to make the best of it. It was a spectacular sunrise. Everything happened fast. The sun hit the rocks and then the fog started to rise uh, from the forest. So I needed to move quickly and to try and capture those, those first moments when the sun hits the, hits the rocks. And um, now I think it's time for me to take my gear and move into the forest. And I'm I'm hoping to to have to capture the fog into the forest, but we'll see when we get there. There is no fog into the forest right now. And I don't have time to climb until I uh, see the fog. Either way, I'm going to stay and take some photos. Again, the white of the snow and the colors of fall are blending together and create a great, a great contrast. Even if there is no sunlight, the early morning light has a special feeling attached to it. And you are also in a certain mood and you see things in a certain way. Uh, try it for yourself. Early morning in the forest, not that dark so you can see the compositions. Try that for yourself and convince yourself that it's going to be a special moment. I think this was it for today. 
I've managed to capture a beautiful sunrise and some great photos into the forest. So for me, it's a successful day. Now I really hope I have time to edit these photos and edit this vlog and post it uh, because this weekend I'm starting one of my workshops in uh, Paramures historic region of Romania. But I'll try to do it and if you're hearing this it means that it's online, it's okay. So the only thing that's, that remains right now is uh, to hope that you are inspired to go out and photograph and be out in nature and until next time keep on photographing it's the only way you can get better thanks for watching and bye bye